bucket. I got it in the warehouse. Huh? <laughs> this is the best part of the show, by the way, just letting you know. <laughs> Soil keys of pussy. <laughs> Yep, that's me. Woo, what's up, family? You know me. Scarecrow today. If I only had a brain. The Soil King. I'm here with my favorite product, Mr. B's Green Trees. You guys that know me out here, I love this. This is what I use. I use a lot of Soil King approved products, and this goes on everything. This is a great friend of mine, Matt, right here. Matt's going to tell us a little bit about his product. Sure. Well, so this is a uh, dry top dress amendment fertilizer. You can till it in your soil first. Uh, real easy to use. Well, we're all about simplicity. Things out there are just way too hard. And we were like, you know, let's make something that everybody can use and get great results. And we're going to talk a little bit about the application today, just so just how easy that can be. Well, great. Let's uh, go ahead and do some applications on the giant pumpkin patch. All right. Come on, brother. Back with you, family. We're gonna do some green trees application. Show us how it's done. Matt, you wanna take it over from here? For sure. Well, there's a couple different options, but what we'll show here is one of the easiest ways. You just take, we happen to have a little cup here handy. We say you can use about a cup in a 10 square foot area. This is a circle. This isn't exactly a cup. That's the nice thing about our products. This isn't rocket science. Put it right in here. A little bit extra there. Sprinkle around. I take a little water here. I mean, it's that simple. This isn't rocket science, folks. But you're gonna get results that you thought they were. Yeah, this is awesome. So the difference between using this and a liquid fertilizer would be most of the time, liquids are 100% available at the time of application. But using dry fertilizers, you're adding uh, materials that are going to break down over time and continuously feed plants throughout a season. There's, a, there's 17 different materials in here that all have different rates of breakdown. So when one of our nitrogen sources or phosphorus sources stops delivering nutrients, the other one's just kicking into play. So you're getting a nice continuous feeding. So we just applied the top dress. There's other ways we can do this. Hey Matt, what's another way we can uh, apply it? While we were just talking about the difference between this and liquid fertilizers, let's take a little field trip to a liquid fertilizer factory. Awesome, let's Here's do the it. Bucket. Here's the material. You put it in there. That easy? Let's put it right on this tree, how about that? <laughs> that's that. And that's how it's done right there. Giant pumpkins, here we come. Thank you, family. Get that big roots. What are you doing? You need help over there? Soil keys of pussy. <laughs> 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 